Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the channel. It is a new week, and if you have not seen what I did on my birthday, I will leave that birthday vlog here. It's still the birthday week, but I'm separating the vlogs. Al and I, we are out and about already, and we are headed to Summit One Vanderbilt, which is an amazing observation deck, so let's go inside. <laughs> back home from the summit. If you're looking for like an amazing view of New York, I really recommend that observation deck. I've been to them all, so they all have like pros and cons. That one is very, very, very busy. So definitely you have to get your tickets in advance and I'll leave a link down below. It is really cool to go see the view, the city. This is a part of my birthday week. So it's kind of like a fun little festivity that we did. Now I'm back home. Usually we spend weekends over at El Senio's apartment. So I'm just getting ready for that because we have more Broadway shows to go to. So I'm basically like just planning out what I'm gonna wear. I had to bring it with me to his house, but I did get a really fun delivery. Let me show you a new kitchen table. So I had a black table in here and basically long story short, it's in El Sunny's apartment now and I didn't feel like bringing it back here. So I ordered a new one and I'm excited to see what this looks like. It's from Wayfair. It's like honestly on the cheaper end of things because I don't know how long we're living here. So it's kind of like just a table to have because obviously there was nothing in here. I just painted this wall. So I wanted like a nice table in here and I do want to see what the color looks like. So the color is like a light wood color. Oh, I think that's gonna be really pretty actually with the walls, gonna have like a pretty earthy tone in here. So here's a better look at the table. She's on the bit of the grayer side, but I actually like it. It's a nice light wood, obviously it's engineered wood, but I'm going to assemble this later this week. So you'll see what it looks like in, later in this vlog, but I'm excited that I finally have a table. Right, the golden hour just ended here and it was so beautiful. Now we're gonna get some dinner and then head to the off-Broadway show. I'm really excited about it. It's like 1920s theme. And we're gonna head to a place I wanted to eat at for so long. It's like the cutest little Greek restaurant. We've walked by like so many different times and I'm like, I always wanted to sit there. So today we're gonna go cause it's been like a year since I've been saying that and we're going to see if it's any good. So let's head out. So it's like this cute little outdoor place. You can people watch. So we're drinking some Greek wine from called Koros, and we ordered some zucchini chips. I haven't had it it's been so long. So we're seeing Only Gold, based in Paris in 1928. It looks really cool. Like the set is so pretty. is in my hair and I got this little hair curler on Amazon. I've seen it for so long and I wanted to buy this for my summer travels because when I travel, I usually wash my hair at night. Like I sleep on wet hair and I wake up with like the craziest hair. So this is something you put in your hair after you shower, your hair air dries to like this like tube. You can do this with socks, but I feel like this is just kind of like an easier thing. So there's a clip right here and I'm going to see how this turned out. Sorry, my window's open because it's such a nice breeze. But I think, look at that. It really does 
work it's crazy my hair is still kind of a bit on the wet side i know you're not really supposed to do it until your hair is like completely dry but look at that with no heat that's crazy i'm loving it it looks insane like i actually look crazy <laughs> i don't know how you could take anyone serious wearing it but for the curls i think it just works and it's just an easy way to like have your hair styled without trying too hard of course you could probably go in and like style some other pieces but you know what i'm gonna take it because now my hair is done all right so it's sunday and i am just so here for a relaxing sunday it's actually pretty nice out but i have to do some errands i have to do grocery shopping laundry i have to assemble that table which i'm really excited about I'll probably do that right now and what else oh yeah it was such a treat this weekend because i saw two shows the first one only gold was in the mcc theater which is a smaller theater so it was off broadway it was very like choreography dance heavy so if you like dance dancing that one was amazing it was like 1920s paris like a love story it was really cool actually like the dancing itself was amazing and then last night al and i we saw almost famous on broadway it's based on the almost famous movie with kate hudson i actually never seen the movie but i did watch the trailer after the show there seems to be like the similar clips from the movie in the broadway show so if you like the movie i know for a fact you probably would love the musical and it was just a fun like rock and roll 70s vibe and I believe they were smoking real cigarettes on the stage because it smelled like cigarettes and they were smoking the whole time so you kind of got the feeling of being in the 70s so I highly enjoyed it so now I think we should tackle the table I literally just read these instructions <laughs> I've never seen a shorter like assembly. All you do is just to attach the legs to the top. This might take me five minutes. I'm so excited. Okay, so let me see what I have to do. I love also like, assembling furniture when I'm in the mood. I think it's really fun. And this is the final reveal, my new table. I love it. And actually, I like the fact that I can tuck in the chairs like perfect. At least two chairs I can tuck in like that because if I tuck them all in, these chairs won't go in. However, I only have one other chair, so. And it's like the same color as my console over here so it's the same color i do wish it was like a beautiful like oak wood color but like for the price quick delivery and the size and the overall style this one checked all the boxes the quality is pretty good i do have an amazon box i want to unbox with you it's exciting to me because it's like adulting but i'll show you that later and the green wall i think that just like looks really 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 pretty so i am loving it Yay! I am so excited. So my parents are actually going to visit me in New York for the Christmas season and I just booked some Broadway tickets for them to see. I have seen a lot of Broadway shows but I think the show that they are going to just love is the Michael Jackson show. So I just got them tickets for December and by the way they are like selling out like this weekend Saturday sold out. They do have resale tickets but they are so expensive. So like if you're coming to New York or you want to see Broadway and you want to see a show that you really really want to see like book it now for especially for the Christmas season because it is busy like it is so much busier than it was in the past couple of years but we got our ticket I'm excited I'm so excited all right let's do a little fun unboxing I said that I had a package in from Amazon so let's open it up so I ordered some new sheets I know Amazon has like 100 sheets to try and I got these because these were 100% cotton. I like cotton sheets. Basically just a bright white pair of sheets. I use them every day and I only have two pairs and doing laundry all the time to wash my sheets has been annoying. So I just needed a new setup. So these, I wanna see if they're soft though. Ooh, these are very nice. Yeah, these are a winner. I actually really, really like these. It says to wash them before, so I'll probably do a lot of laundry right now, but yeah, they actually feel really, really good. I will leave these links below if you're on the hunt for new sheets. So I'm gonna wash these and then put them on the bed. All right, my camera battery just died, so I also got another pair of these sheets. The next item, 
So I've been wearing this one shirt like in every video. So I ordered it in a different color because I've gotten like so much wear out of it. It's this mock neck like sweater top. It's this mock neck sweater top I've been wearing everywhere. Like how cute is this top? I am obsessed with it. Oh yeah, I'm happy that I got this. I've been wearing the black one literally all the time with like my trousers. A white, I know I'm looking at the white one. I know I'd probably wear that a lot. But they also have it in like a pretty burgundy color. So, and then in my Amazon video, I tried out a few different blazers and I really like the fit of the Blake blazer. So I ordered it in a black color because I like the fit of this one better rather than the like oversized fit blazers. So let me see. I am like looking like I'm going to work or something. This is just very cute. I'm happy with the fit of this one. Then I got a PR package from this brand called Duo Boots. They are individually wrapped. A plain black to the knee boot has a zipper right here. I am going to be wearing these, I think, so much. They're very, very comfortable. See what they look like because you're not seeing anything. Ignore the mask behind me, but these are what the boots look like. They have a heel, but they are not too high. So like these are gonna be a great like everyday to the knee boot where my other ones are kind of like too high to be like an everyday like walking shoe. But I love the fit of these. They are very, very cute. Okay, I totally get why they say to wash your sheets before you put them on the bed because they are so much softer. I am loving these. I'll probably change my sheets like tomorrow because I don't really feel like doing it right now. All right, I am out and about. I'm headed to a Mavi jeans preview. So I'm actually gonna wear some of my Mavi jeans. Mavi jeans is a denim brand and I'm gonna go see what's new for spring and I'm just wearing a cute little blazer, bodysuit. Basically, this is just like my fall uniform. And so yeah, I'm ready to go. It's a beautiful sunny day out. And by the way, I did change my sheets and now that these sheets are just so white, my actual like other bedding just looks like cream. So they do have this in like a soft white, probably like this color so it isn't like so stark, but I think over time the bright white will actually kind of fade away into a cream color, but I love them. They are, the sheets are just so soft. Mavi event saw all that's new really liked this patchwork denim set it's like a skirt a jacket and pants really cute and I also was really loving their sustainable line actually by 2030 the whole brand is gonna be sustainable in their fabrics how they make it and everything but they have a lot of sustainable options as well there was even a calligrapher there and I got a candle etched with whatever I wanted on the candle. A lot of people do like their initials or their name, but I feel like it's weird to like light a candle up with your name on it. I don't know. So instead of a name, I got the word believe on it. I think it's just cute for the upcoming holiday season. And also it could be a gift if I wanna gift this, but this smells amazing. This candle brand is called Kobo and they are handmade in New York from non-GMO domestically grown soy, compostable and plantable. So it's a sustainable candle company and this poppy smells amazing. Like I'm actually, like not even joking, I am a candle hoarder. I'm that person who goes and buys candles. Now I have a whole closet in the front of like candles that I haven't lit yet. And tonight I'm actually going to a candle event. So today's a good day. I love candles, you guys. I just love them so much. I also got a Starbucks on the way home. I was gonna walk the High Line a little bit, which is a raised train track here in New York. It had beautiful fall foliage, but after this event, I ended up talking to this girl who is from Turkey and she was telling me all the amazing places that I need to go visit in Turkey and I'm like, you sold me. So, and I basically got the oat milk shaken espresso in a hot drink. It's not the same, but they use like the same syrups and it's just such a guilty pleasure. So I'm gonna sip this, work on my computer for a bit. We've made it to 
Rockefeller Center in a few weeks. This will all be Christmas out. It looks like they're constructing something. But we are finding the new candle store and let's see if the rink is open yet. So they are constructing the rink and they are building up the rink. Very classic New York area. And I think we're gonna go in here, rink level to get to the store. They even have some holiday lights up and we are going inside. Inside 30 Rock. Yeah. Ooh, that does smell really good. Okay, so this one smells amazing. I vlogged about this in the past. I actually need it. It's really good. Amazing. All right, I am so excited because Al figured this whole thing out. We won tickets to see Moulin Rouge. It's this thing called Lucky Seat and you basically enter a seating lottery. It's better if you live in the city because obviously it was so last minute. We won the tickets last night. So we are headed to Moulin Rouge. It's been on my wish list for so long and we're about to go right now. So I'm wearing this really pretty cheetah print dress and it's gonna be a fun day of entertainment because after that we're actually going to a movie screening so let's come along we have a fun day of a fun event all right here is our matinee i am so excited My goodness what an amazing show that was it's so weird to leave broadway when it's still sunny out because we've been going all to the later shows but i highly recommend it's like amazing costumes amazing set design the set design was insane it was so good and the music was like pop music so basically you know every song which i like because you can kind of sing along if you want hang at the house for a little bit and then we're gonna head to a movie premiere here for the little screening. I am super pumped. Let's go have some bites before the movie. Some for seeds, rum, topped with that mark. All right, so I'm back from the movie. I'm ready in my pajamas. I'm going to wash up all the makeup. And what a fun day, honestly. I feel like it's only a Wednesday, but I feel like so much fun, so much entertainment. And oh, look. Al got me a happy birthday balloon. I guess we're celebrating all month long at this point because it's been a week since my birthday and we're still celebrating. And then tonight's movie was really, really fun. It was basically like George Clooney and Julia Robert are like divorced and they like try to rekindle their marriage even though they don't really want to. And it's in Bali, so like the whole scenery is just stunning. Like honestly, I want to book a plane ticket tonight and just travel because it makes you want to travel. So it comes out on Friday. By the time this video goes out, it'll already be out in the theater. So if you want like a fun like girls night with that, I hope you guys have an awesome day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.